Ladies and gentlemen, we are ready to move on with our second bout of the evening. So would you welcome into the red corner, Bui Femi Balogun. K1 over three two minute rounds of action as sponsored by Campbell Nutrition. And in the red corner, she weighed in at 157 pounds, representing LMTA, Bui Femi Balogan. And her opponent in the blue corner, she weighed in at 159 pounds, representing House of Pain. Daria Schmidt! Your referee in charge of the action, Mr. Andrew Nichols. Lightweight K1 rules out of the red corner from LMTA. Bowie Femi Balogun taking on the House of Pain tonight, and Daria Schmidt. Two exciting female strikers and some beautiful kicking going on from both to start things off, Dean. Schmidt coming from the House of Pain, absolutely hardcore there. They've got some brilliant fighters coming out of that camp. So Balogun has got her work cut out here, but she's doing great with these leg kicks thus far. And Bowie doing a great job of kicking the front leg with that front and rear teeth. Look at the way she leans back, drawing in for the counter, swinging a miss with the right, high round kick but then chops the lead leg. Beautiful technical footwork from both of these two right away, Dean. So I love about the female fights, Chris. They're technically brilliant, and the flexibility is there, and, and the power as well with these two athletes in front of us. We might see a knockout. Brilliant work from both women attacking the legs, but it's Bowie who smacks home with that right one. Oh, Bowie's got some heavy hands here. But covering up very nicely in response is Daria. And I love how Bowie continues to attack the chin, but kick out the legs. Well, he's got a great counter left hook. Schmidt needs to stop walking forward. She needs to create angles, Chris, to get in there. She can't walk onto those punches. But holding her guard very nicely high is Daria Schmidt. The House of Pain fighter gonna need it. One, two, ten. Inside leg kick. Nice. Another swing and a miss, though, for Bowie. Schmidt did a great job of making her miss, but this will be the wrong tactic. Standing in front of her. Ho, ho, ho. The two continue to go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Both females trading off here, toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Schmidt showed us a nice angle there. 
moved out the way. Oh, beautiful. Now she needs to move off the center line and counter. She can't stand in front of Boo. Oh my goodness, these two females are absolutely going at it. <laughs> the heart, the grit, the determination here on display and a break from the clinch. Just seconds left in the round. Man, the crowd on their feet here tonight in Kent Dean. Two females going at it here in the LFC. A showcase of skill and, and heart, Chris. They've gone toe to toe thus far. Another round of matchmaking insanity here on tap tonight at LFC K1 Rules. Chris Hookster calling it with Dean Manhattan. Dean, an entertaining fight to the max thus far. Schmidt coming out looking a bit more, less confident, Chris. But Bowie's certainly ready to exchange at kicking distance again. I love how she uses that front and rear leg. Constantly switches things up, but you can see the tactics from Schmidt. She wants to get inside. She wants to make this one a fight in the phone booth. Balogun wants the trade-off. Coming off with the big left hooks here with those power punches on the inside. Schmidt's got some great footwork. She showed some good kicks in the first round. There's another one there. She's to keep her distance and create angles, Chris. And more importantly, set those kicks up with punches, Dean. Multiple punch combinations and follow with the kick. Much better there. The right cross getting through for both women, but it's again that front leg teat for Bowie that has delivered the space she wants to operate from. Balogun on the outside here, looking for a way in. She's looking for her opening, Chris, and then she'll explode with those big, heavy punches. Doesn't want to get caught by too many of those kicks because that will slow the spring in her punches. Take away the power, Chris. And Bowie looking for that left hook again. But some great blocking going on. Schmidt's really going for it, Dean. She thinks she may have lost that first round listening to the corner work there, and so she's definitely pressing Bowie onto the back foot. See Schmidt there, a shake of her head. She can't let her confidence falter here. She needs to stick to her game plan, use those kicks to get in and create angles. Again, Bowie with the right hook, set off by the jab, long slappy jab from Bowie. Balogun on the outside with those big jabs, a big smile there. She knows she's finding her mark with those lead jabs. Nice kick there by Balogun. And that was a great adjustment from Bowie where you're taking on a fighter in Schmidt who wants to charge straight in. That jab certainly a successful tool in countering that, Dean. She's able to just contact him, just being able to feel where her opponent is, and then she can trade off the big shots or move out of the way of those kicks. Bowie, again, as you said, it was a bit of touch-pull return there throughout that round. Some great boxing from Bowie, but some great aggression and ring control from Schmidt as well. Schmidt clearly not backing down for the fight. She needs to be careful about those head shakes, not let her confidence falter and stick to her game plan. Balogun equally do more of the same. Head referee Andrew Nichols. The ring door has been sealed. It's the third and final round, and what has been a thrilling contest. Boy, beautiful team there by Balogun. Sent Schmidt stumbling backwards. And Schmidt waltzes onwards as if nothing happened. Schmidt with the big... Dirty boxing courtesy of the right hand. Balogun waiting on the outside. Look, watch first. She's looking for that kick. That rear kick, and then she's going to come in with that big left hook. Circling beautifully on the outside there. Nice lateral movement there from Balogun. Bowie, again, that inside and outside leg work has been very tight. Oh. But the problem is, Schmidt's got her timing down and is coming in at a much better moment. She's been more opportunistic in this round. Schmidt here, handling back. Waiting for that time, nice and bouncy there. Eats a left hook, shakes it off. Nice right hand there by Schmidt. And Bowie on the back foot once again, but Schmidt operating with much more accuracy and certainly some better connection in the power department. Bowie's oh. head snaps back. Schmidt what? waiting tight. The timing is the key now, Chris, in this later round. Schmidt is clearly waiting for her ample opportunity to strike. She's not rushing in like before. And choosing her shots is the House of Pain fighter. Bowie continues to back off, spits the mouthpiece out. Now, could that have been uh, a genuine mistake or could she want to get a breather there? Maybe she's getting overwhelmed in this last round. Oh, he's a big shot. And what a round for Schmidt. Breathing heavily, bites down on her mouthpiece and continues to pump forward with the right cross. But then Bowie responds, stiff jab from Bowie. Right cross and a left hook to finish it off. Both females toe to toe, beautiful kick there from Bowie. 
eats, oh, eating these punches from Schmidt straight down the pipe. And Bowie's got to continue to lead with that jab. That's what certainly frustrated Schmidt the most in the last round. But Schmidt stalks her woman down. Right cross again for Schmidt. Oh, wow, that was an absolute bomb burner. Toe to toe, these two females. The crowd on their feet here in Rochester tonight. Another round, I think, is wanted by the audience, but we'll have to go over to the judges' scorecards, do the mathematics, and add this one up to see who walks away the winner. The ladies and gentlemen, before I make the official announcement, I think you'll agree, an early contender for fight of the night. What an incredible bout from these two ladies. But we do have a unanimous decision. Our judges in favor of the red corner, Bowie Femi Balogun.